Many activities may be impacted by some big thunderstorms later today and this evening, so just be aware of that. Everything should start moving in from the west and southwest in that mid to late afternoon period, so keep an eye to the sky. A quiet morning for us. We've been mainly clear through the overnight with thunderstorms well south. A little bit of that is kind of nudged up into Coffee and Anderson counties. This morning we have a little bit forming in our northwest counties, but otherwise quiet. 51, dew point 49. That's pretty close together and with a clear sky, very light wind of anything, and your up a dew point pretty close. There might be some patchy fog out there. There's our slight risk of severe weather, but you get outside of Junction City and Chapman and Abilene and down toward Council Grove, it does become enhanced a bit there. And some of these thunderstorms may produce larger hailstones and even some rainfall amounts uh, that end up being in the one to two inch category, if not more than that. And as such, we have our flash flood watch in the western counties, and that runs until early morning tomorrow. And we still have some issues down to the far south, the darker green representing flood warnings and those are river flood warnings but so many lakes are completely full since that's a part of the entire system so we have almost record levels on some lakes our dew point still in the 40s but a little bit higher down to the south with low 50s but it's not terribly humid and there's a look at your numbers 54 Kansas City Lawrence at 50 degrees this morning we have some 40s out toward Marysville and Washington and then right back to low 50s again just southwest of that a bit cooler in the Rockies and there's still just a little hit of snow in a couple of spots there are your wide spread 70s, a really warm and steamy morning across areas of Texas, Oklahoma, and the lower Mississippi Valley. And some of these thunderstorms have been severe through Oklahoma and also into Arkansas and running into areas of Missouri. A lot of that pushing toward the east and again, relatively quiet right now, but later today, there's going to be a spoke of upper energy come from a system in the southwest deserts and that will kick off some showers and storms. This morning, mainly a random shower or possible tiny thunderstorm, but then later today, we get the action to build in central Kansas. This is going to be in that three to five o'clock period that comes sweeping through this evening. And again, there's the potential for flash flooding with that and also some larger hailstones. It stays pretty active in the late night toward morning. Some more storms come through, dumping more rainfall, and then we'll have some scattered action for Friday even into Saturday. So with our forecast today, we're going to shoot for mid 70s. And then as we go through the day tomorrow, some scattered storms at 81. And that's the temp that you get all the way through the holiday weekend. Forecast highs around 80 to 84. Overnight lows in the 60s, so the air becoming a bit humid. And then your thunderstorm chances begin to wane just a little bit toward the holiday, and it could become pleasant in the middle part of next week. We're back with so much more. Stick around as long as you can.